At around $150, the Huawei MediaPad T310 is a quite inexpensive 9.6 inch Android tablet. Because of that, Huawei is not giving us the best internal hardware. But how good is the performance? Is the MediaPad T3 powerful enough to play most games? That's what you will find out in my gaming and benchmark test. As with all my gaming reviews, I played a couple of different games on the Huawei MediaPad T310. Not as demanding ones like Angry Birds and Raymond Adventures run without any problems. Even though the 9.6 inch screen offers an HD resolution only, games with a nice graphic look great. The resolution is not high, but colors look nice and the contrast is good. I expected Asphalt Extreme to run smoothly as well and that is indeed the case. While the graphics don't look as nice as on higher end devices, it is playable quite nicely. If you've seen my gaming test of the Lenovo Tab 48, you might notice a lot of similarities, because the hardware is identical. As with this competitor, Dead Trigger 2 runs surprisingly well on the MediaPad 332. You might notice some very minor lags occasionally if a lot of apps are open in the background though. That goes for other apps as well. It's not the best multitasking tablet. So while the games I tried until now run great, the same is not the case for Modern Combat 5. While you can install and play it, it suffers from some heavy lags, mainly during action heavy sequences. Like with other tablets with the Snapdragon 425 like the Lenovo Tab 48 or Samsung Galaxy Tab A 8.0, Modern Combat 5 is not really playable. By the way, in addition to this chipset we are getting 2GB of RAM and a 16GB internal storage. The results of my benchmark tests are not surprising. In Geekbench 4, the MediaPad T3 gets 680 points in the single core test and 1900 points in the multi core test. In Antutu, it gets a result of 37700 points. So the tablet gets almost identical results to the much cheaper Amazon Fire HD8. So, is the Huawei MediaPad T310 a good gaming tablet? Well, as you've seen, you are able to play a lot of games on it. Some, like Modern Combat 5, suffer from heavy lagging though. The 16GB internal storage is a bit too small to install a lot of games as well. If you're looking specifically for a gaming tablet, then I cannot recommend the MediaPad T3. The new Amazon Fire HD 10 is a very interesting alternative here. It costs about the same. While it's not shipping with the Google Play Store, the performance is much better. Alright, that's my gaming and benchmark test with the Huawei MediaPad T310. If you've got any questions, just write them down below. I'm NJ for MyNextTablet.com. Thanks for watching.